I have come up with an idea for the door. This is some aluminum C channel I have. I cut half off. This is just a tester piece. I'm going to be cutting one half off. That'll go around the uh, door. That'll be the frame. Then I've got this stuff. This is a picture frame. It gets held together with the little angled pieces with screws in them. That's going to become the actual door. Okay, so here's my plan. I'm going to cut chunks of wood, take out the styrofoam here, and put wood in. Same as what we got over here so that I got to do it on the side and the top so that I have something to screw into and these are gonna be my frame this is just a tester piece Screw those in around. And there'll be another piece of aluminum coming off the back here for the backstop for the door and the uh, weather seal. But that's the plan. Hope it works.
Well, it's not perfect. But good enough. Now I just got to cut one side of it all off. Yay. So, there's all the trim pieces made. Finish on them ain't nice, but I'm going to look into fixing that. Okay. Now I got to look into putting these on the opening where I took the hot water tank from. Measure out what exact size I have after that, and then use these to make my door.
getting ready to drill the holes to connect the frame. I've already marked out all the places that I need the holes drilled. took the flapper wheel, we're going to call it sandpaper grinder wheel. Didn't give it a smooth finish, but sure made it look a lot better.
Well, not perfect. But it'll definitely do as a frame. That's the worst of them all, but that's okay. Right now, I'm just measuring for the door I need to make. Too bad. It's over a foot and a half. It's over a foot and a half. Right on a foot and a half. You know, a foot and a half. May not look pretty, but surprisingly enough, it is square. Nice. And there's a temporary fix until I make the door. <laughs>